Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on New Woodshire. How is everybody doing today? Uh, I'm doing good. Uh, just got done with the field again. Uh, field 22 I believe. Uh, did take it. There's Port Green Elevator up where you have to be under the railroad track. Uh, so, oh. Where is he? he? He don't come from that way. He comes from this way. Oh, there he is. We'll watch the train. Well, anyway, um, I was doing that field and doing three color, uh, cultivator mission or contracts. I'll get it out here in a minute, folks. None of the contracts for the color cultivators work right I got their own tractors and everything uh, went and done them one at a time well not one at a time you know I started one then I went and got back and started another one then I went back to the market shop started a third one got them all going and one worked one worked the other two were still showing 50%. So I can't do contracts. I can do one at a time, but it seems like if I do more, something must be wrong with the mod or something. I, I have no idea. But anyway, the contract is done on that field, and it's to Port Grain Elevator. And I'm going to show you all before I dump. Before I take a dump, oh wait, huh? Oh, that's nasty, Mr. Blue. Uh, but first, uh, our field is almost ready and that and uh, for uh, mowing. But ours in the wood right here, as you can see, this little circle here is extremely ready. Um, sugar beets right here, uh, pork grain elevator is down because that's where I've been taking the contract sugar beets to but we're gonna dump ours right here for 125 just to show you the contract is done it's completed field 22 and y'all see the things here and it's showing done so I'm gonna go ahead and because if I accept that right now this tractor is gonna disappear so I'm Dumping it, getting, trying to get where y'all can see it. We're up to 10,000, 11,000, 11,516, and that was $2,832 worth of stuff there. Now, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to hit X to collect this. Voila. Come back. The tractor's gone. And I made 16361 brings us to 27,878. That's good and that's bad. Because I had to go in here and borrow. I'm up to 565,000. Oh, yeah. Y'all fix and see why here. A little magic. Ding! Yes, folks, I bought the Big Daddy Wood Chipper Stump Grinder. Just, I, I had to. The little small limbs on these trees, oh, it was giving me a nerve rack. Nerve rack, I tell you. Come over here. <laughs> uh, don't do this at home, kids. This is very unsafe. So we're going to go and haul this off. And, and folks, yeah, and, since I couldn't haul, uh, logs, yeah, that truck's squatting, I had this filled up with, well, it is still filled up with, uh, logs, as you can see right there, but, uh, somebody told me this 
put wood chips on top of them, they'll take them anyway. So, I hope that's true, but this one here is full of wood chips. So, we're going to go haul this off real quick, and I will meet y'all at Sawmill. I'm going to take both of them up there. I don't know which one I'm going to do. I think I'm going to put follow me on this truck so I can drive the tractor. Because that tractor, <laughs> I got to be more careful of it. Alright, folks. Uh, control, right control, and F. And I'm about 35. We'll make that about 40. And, yeah, we're going to go get, it's not going to be that much money, but, <sighs> yeah. I, I just, I don't know what we're going to really do but with all this, but uh, I'll meet y'all at the sawmill, and maybe I'll have time to think about more stuff, okay? You following back here? Oh, yeah. Alright, I'll see y'all at the sawmill. Alright, I got both of them up here, folks. We're going to sell right now. $8,864. Ooh, brings up to, what is that, $36,674? Alright. That one's empty. This one's empty with the logs. But still got the wood chips. I don't know where to take it. Uh, we gotta go find, I think it's around back over. So this load basically going to pay for the wood chipper, what it looks like. Um, maybe over here. Okay, folks, I don't see no more things on the ground. Oh, oh, right there. I was going to make a course play route with this, but they always put the wood chips in the worst place. It'd be hard doing a turn here for course play. Um... Let's see, get on the truck. I'll probably have to unhook the trailer. Oh, uh, well, there's the trailer. Oh, you're dumping the wrong way. But it'll be alright. Put it up there so y'all can see the money at the top right. Alright, that one's empty. 577. Not bad. Unhook. Alright, Mr. Why? Let me get the trailer out of the way. We might have to get us a different truck or something. Matter of fact, there is a truck I've been looking at, but I don't know if we can afford it or not. Could always uh, talk to the bank manager, right? Oh, I had a trigger. That's way back there for it. Well, I had a trigger. Right there. Wow. Oh. Come on. It was started to dump and I hit it again and it The sweet spot.
Let's see if that did it. Oh, wow. All right, folks, let me get this dumped and I'll be right back. All right, very unrealistic. My tires up off the ground, but I found a spot that will work. So yeah, this this truck ain't gonna be able to. Eight hundred and seventy dollars brings us to thirty nine thousand and fifty five dollars. Still not enough to do anything with. Let me get these guys back to the farm shop, folks, and uh, I think what we're going to do is, eh, I really don't know. I, I, I think we're going to get another load of trees, but this time around, we're going to go far back up to our forest at the north farm. This, actually, I need to grab no more. That's what I need to do. I'm just going to grab the mower and we're going to go mowing. And uh, yeah, so I'll be right back after I get all that set up. Oh, there, I'm sure I almost forgot where it was at. Be right back. All right, before we get going mowing, got to feed the horses. They're getting mighty low. So we're going to go get that one bell that rolled down the hill. And we're going to put it in. Oh, it's kind of a low spot in there. The sheep's are doing pretty good. And just to show y'all, look up across their fields are doing nice and green. I, I like that. It's that green money. Look at the grass growing there. And soybeans up there. Um, I, I need to plant because if we haven't planted this top field up here yet I keep forgetting about it we need to put corn in that there's our bale and here's our track ooh if I don't walk into there our sheep's looking pretty getting all that good wool don't want to drive out on the field yet because it's still growing pretty good Forks line, and there we go. Four thousand liters of hay. Hey, hey, hey. Here y'all go, horsies. There we go. Oh, there goes my phone. Never fails. Um, sheeps are half and half, so they're pretty good for now. And yeah, now we brought it up a little, a little bit. Maybe I need to give another one. Well, folks, I'll be right back. All right. I topped off the horses. <clears throat> Excuse me. Learn. <clears throat> I topped off the horses with a uh, straw and decided I need this loader wagon emptied so and collect some loose hay that way we can put it into the silo here and we can also top the horses and our sheep off before we do that whatever we have left we'll put it in the silo so here we are with the straw um, I don't really believe in this. I, there might be some silos out there that takes everything, but I've always been the one, you know, your grain went in the grain and the rest of it was bailed, but uh, as this me, you know, I, I haven't seen one, so I'm, I'm pretty sure there is one out there, but um, I need some guys to go back with me. Yeah. Um. Oh, stupid tree or stupid me. I'm always running into a tree. Um, I think we're going to drop off the 
subsolar. Because we got to, we got to get a planter going. So, uh, yeah. I keep forgetting about that. We got to go plant corn up there in that top field. I'm going to drop that right there. And plus this guy needs to bring back some tater. Or not back up there. I'm talking about back to here when we're done planting corn. Um, we got to hook one up on tether, another on the wind roller. So let's just go ahead and bring back the Udden too, just in case. We'll we'll leave the other four wheel drive up here because I got three more trees I want to take down. And, but I'm not using that truck. <laughs> now we'll we'll a couple trips with the little trailers or something. Oh oh got got the well. Let me see if this and I I know this and don't take don't do corn. Let's see that's probably right here. No, it does not do corn. So we would need, I uh, probably won't, no, it's not going to be in that. It's going to be these up here. Yeah, I don't want to buy one. I just want to lease one. That one does corn, but I uh, know. Let's get one that's a little bit bigger. I don't need to seed and fertilize. I just need to, nine meters, that might be a little bit too big. That and there are the seeds. And it looks like a three point hitch. Six meters, nine mile an hour. Kind of my style. I think that will work. Let's see what else we got over here. Um, might have something that's older. Oh. Now I could buy that, and that's 7,500. Seeds, oh, it's liquid fertilized. And both of them. Hmm. I wonder if I can use it without the fertilized. What the case? And yeah, all of them takes liquid fertilizer. Hmm. You know what? Seven mile an hour, oh, but it's nine meters. I don't know what that was. It's probably a wage payment. You know what, folks? Well, I don't know if we need a cyst on or not. We're going to try this and see if uh, at least one of them should do it, and that's 8,000. That way we don't have to worry about leasing or anything anymore. And I know it's green, but hey, we need to get a green tractor. Uh, we're going to leave this planter here. Let's see. I think this is lime over here. Yeah, that's lime. We'll get this tractor to follow us, and we'll get the uh, our newest uh, case right here to do the planter. So let's see. Control F. Uh, one is going to go thirty. Been having pretty good luck with thirty. This one's four wheel drive, it's got a heavy front end on it, and it should should handle the planer. Control F. Alright. Ah, ah, wow. Just looking and admiring them, folks. Um, also, I want to buy a mower, too, so. Let me get these guys situated, and I will be right back, folks. Before y'all even say anything, I know what you're fixing to say. Don't say it. No, I really don't know what y'all is going to say, folks. Uh, we got this in here by Stevie. 70 horse, 3.1, 16 mile an hour. We can attach it to this one. You got the John Deere one here, 90 horse, 3.5, 20 mile an hour. Yeah, and uh, I don't know if it'll attach with this one or not, but it, it's shown 
I know you can use this at the back, but and this on the front. But this is one we're going to get. It's ten thousand. Why not pay an extra nine thousand? You know, four mile nine, which it's not going to matter right now because we're going to have the um the disc bind behind this ball and two. So we we going to go ahead and get this. And there's no upgrades or anything. This comes as it is. We're going to buy. I know we're buying a lot of stuff. We still got twenty thousand though. And it's going to help us out a lot. Yeah. Here's our planner we got. It seems to be working pretty good. Of course, it ain't full of seeds right now either. Uh, go ahead and hook up to the mower on the front first. We're going to go to the shop. Now, I think... And it's already selling corn too. I'm just going to use the seeds we got to save a little money. So, yeah. Whoa. What was that? I'm always running over stuff that's not there. Anyway, let me get this back to the shop and I'll be right back. And this is why we don't get large equipment through here, folks. This barely, barely fits. Oof. Yeah, I probably wonder why I haven't done anything to the sugar beets and the potatoes. I gave up on them, folks. I gave up on them. Yeah. And this is why we need a, uh, another way in. Yeah, a little tight through here, but not as tight as that bridge. Alright, I'm going to drop the mower off. And we're going to go get some seeds. Oh, it's tight up in there. Alright, I don't know which one I need to do first. So now I need to go... Um, do some mowing, but we got to get corn in that first. We, we really do. Let me... Uh, part right here. I'm going to move this one tractor out of the way. Oh, that's just so much. I got so many mods, it'd be hard to bring somebody else in, but it'd be nice to I actually have uh, somebody else that can come in and play too. That, that'd be awesome. There's our oats. They are growing big time. Won't be long. Yeah, maybe that'll give us. Let me go ahead and get this tractor out of the way, too. Go ahead and get hooked up to it. And now y'all see what I'm talking about with the disc bind being behind. Go ahead and unfold the disc bind. Oh, don't do it. Oh, do, do. fold the other way. Or at least right there. Yeah, that'll work. Now right, we're going to unfold that and bring that over to all the way over. Now you see the plan I got to try to speed things up. We'll get that set about right there. It should be about perfect. Yeah. I'm going to mow that spot up there off screen and uh want to park there. It's going to be right in the way. Let's go ahead and fold up the disc bind. That should be out of the way. I'll just back up over here just to make sure. Yep. There we go. That should be out of the way there. All right, well, fill this up with seeds, and then uh, probably going to call it an episode. Don't know how many minutes I got so far. But this tractor seems to be handling it quite well, so. All right, don't want to fall off there. And I'm going to go ahead and 
orange fold. And we're gonna drop it down. Are we close? Oh yeah, we're close enough. Well, we was on. Huh? We was on one. Can I back up any further? Right about. Oh, fix that to trailer. Oh, I did hit the trailer. Oh no, our trailer is back heavy now. All right, okay. Move one of these closer. Uh, unstrap. Oh yeah, this one got the funny straps on it. Oh no, no, no. Oh. Um. Okay. Can I get this one? Yeah, I can get this one. Kinda of heavy, yo. All right, let's go suck up in the track, or should I say planter? That and probably do it. I want to see if I will do it. And we don't need no liquid fertilizer up there because we already got it maxed out. Uh, let's see, grow over. And see, it filled six completely, so we don't need fertilizer. I guess I'll go show this a little bit more of us planting it through anyway. But since we got it, we're going to keep it. And this be our corn and everything else planter. We'll get another bigger grain drill, but we got to upsize our tractors a little bit. Yeah, it seems to be handling pretty good. I know if I put that liquid fertilizer back here, it would really, really top it off. <clears throat> now, I don't know if our road markers work or not. I'm just trying to do both same time look and drive too you know how that is kind of dangerous all right we'll go ahead and start unfolding oh yeah it won't take long I don't see nothing for ridge markers so we are set to corn we're going to turn on Still don't see nothing. We're going to lower down. Hmm. No ridge markers. That's a shame. Oh, well. Maybe we'll afford to put GPS on this tractor before long. But we got, what, 20,971 left. I'm thinking about going ahead and putting that in the bank. And, uh, well, there's one more piece of equipment I want to get. I don't know if we can afford it or not. And that's a bell wrapper. Do across the ends here. I wish they would uh, actually do it in rows. It'd be kind of like planting potatoes in a way. How they make the like it's in rows, but it'd be a little bit different. Might well just go ahead and start right here. 
let me make sure this thing is doing yeah we're planting good 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 and this kind of work out about right too because that's our, our soybeans and oats are already on the first stage they'll give us time to harvest them and then by the time this is ready we should be done with the oats and the soybeans that's one thing I kinda like about seasons mod is you know the different planting stages you couldn't plant wheat the same time you planted corn and that kind of gives you time to throw off everything. I need a good screenshot. And then grow it up here. Let me get back out in the field. Alright, let her down. And go. I think I put too much seeds in it, but we can always unload. Which, of course, we still got the other two planters halfway filled with seeds for planting the, the grass over. You know, I think that would make a, a good screenshot right there. But I don't have my, heh, I didn't do the thing. Well, folks, I'm going to leave it right here. I'm going to go ahead and finish this off screen. And uh, when we come back, hopefully I'll have everything uh, together so we can do some mowing. We just had to get the corn in real quick. John Deere Platter. I, I, I like the setup of this. Yeah. See how many rows is it? That's one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's twelve row. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep, twelve row. Twelve row John Deere planter, folks, is ours. Pulling it with a case. I hate Case International. Seventy two fifty pro. That's just that's awesome. But anyway, folks, I appreciate y'all coming out, watching, supporting, all the good stuff, loving. I love each and every one of y'all. And uh, just a big thank you. I can't say that enough. So a big, huge virtual hug and a thank you for all y'all. Um, forgot to do the tags. So uh, I'm going to throw some in right here. All right, go down and show them some love and support, along with the others that's down in the description. Don't, don't forget to go down and check it out the description. I got a lot of stuff down there, a lot of uh, family members. I got my links at the bottom. Uh, at the very bottom is uh, the credits for the music, if I use any. And also, uh, if y'all want to send me some mail or something, my box is down there. Uh, or whatever you want to call it, P.O. Box or Box, it's down there. And, uh, yeah, I appreciate each and every one of y'all folks. So y'all have a great day, a blessed day. I'll see y'all later.